Two American flags stolen right in front of a South Abilene business earlier this week, and it was all caught on camera, as you can see there. K Texas reporter Daniela Barra has this story. We spoke with a business owner who couldn't go on camera, but says he thinks stealing any item, including an American flag, is just wrong. He says that hurts the community as a whole. Just two days after Independence Day, an SUV with a dent near the driver's side pulls into the parking lot of GM4 Tactical and dims their headlights. The driver slowly comes to a stop right in front of a row of American flags. A passenger then hops out and grabs not one, but two of the flags, puts them in the back of the car, then speeds off. I was pretty mad. I mean, I, I wasn't furious, but it's, I don't know. I was kind of taken back. Jesse Lyon is the owner of Flags for Freedom, a company that rents flags for businesses to display around patriotic holidays. This isn't the first time a flag has been stolen from him, but it's the first time he's been able to see it happen. This is aggravating. You know, I know it happens, but, you know, it's still frustrating. Jesse believes displaying the stars and stripes is a way to honor the people who made sacrifices for freedom. To have that symbol stolen, Jesse feels disappointed. It's ironic because, it, you, you know, you'd want a flag to be patriotic, you know, to represent your country, but then, you know, stealing a flag is the opposite of that. The people who stole the flags not only committed a crime, in Jesse's eyes, they're unpatriotic. Think twice before you steal someone else's property. Think twice before you disrespect the flag. If you have any information as to where these flags could be, you're asked to call the Abilene Police Department. Reporting in South Abilene, Daniela Ibarra, KTexas News.